Now, Aussies have always loved and appreciated lamb, eating breeds like Dorpa and Merino. But up here in the rangelands, a couple of hours north of Carnarvon, there's a breed called the Damara that should soon be making its way on a plate to you. The rangeland in WA covers over two thirds of our state and Quapper Station is right in amongst it farming Damara sheep, a breed perfectly suited to the harsh WA climate. Tim Meachin has been farming Damaras here for the last 14 years. So Tim, why Damara? Well, the, the Damaras come out of North Africa um, originally and uh, the, the, the landscape up there is very similar to here, to the rangelands in WA. They look really healthy, so they just eat rangeland food. It's, it's got to be organic, doesn't it? Yeah, look, look as far as uh, inputs into the rangelands and into the animals, there's, there's, uh, you know, we don't fertilise, we, uh, we don't spray pesticides or herbicides, we don't have to drench them, we don't have to dip them, so they're actually chemical free. They've got a, a nice bit of fat on their tail. What is that about? They're a bit like a camel. They store all their excess energy into their tail, so the actual meat on the carcass is very lean. It's so, great. So while it's green, they will eat and store. Absolutely. Beautiful. Well, you know, we've talked about this beautiful Damara sheep. I think proof's in the pudding, as they say, and I, uh, I'd love to have a taste of that. So tonight's the night? Tonight's the night. We've got a couple of chops there ready for you to cook up. Beautiful. Well, I've just scrubbed up after an outside shower at this stunning eco-retreat overlooking Red Bluff on the mighty Quabba Station. But I've worked up an appetite. I'm going to show you how to cook this tasty leg of Damara sheep. To get started, we first need to sear our beautiful leg of damara in my hot campfire pot. Then we season with a little Lake Deborah salt, pepper and a gabinge powder from the Kimberley. Then add in our onions, a little bit of olive oil, saute and stir all together. So what you want to do is sweat off the onions in the olive oil, give them a little bit of colour. I'm going to add in some beautiful West Australian chorizo and some really nice and salty pancetta. So what we'll do is stir that around for a minute. So now I'm going to turn this over, put the lid on and let it cook out for a few minutes. And to finish, add in sweet and WA Kifla potatoes, Gascoigne spring onion, fennel, another slurp of olive oil, dash of a good Margaret River red wine, some curry leaf and parsley. Just before it's finished, add in chilies, Morel's Gascoigne beans, habaneros and button mushrooms. This is going to be the best meal enjoyed by my new mates. So here we have it, slow cooked. Dammer a leg of lamb, cooked with a lot of love, a little bit of red wine, a lot of Gascoigne produce, some great company. What more can you ask for? If you want more information, hit us up on our website.